Accutane, and I was really surprised. Surprised because years earlier, Robin Shermetta was told that drug is too powerful and too risky. Her acne was persistent, but not severe. This time, it didn't seem to matter. When a dermatologist flat out looks you in the face and they tell you, we think this is right for you, it's kind of, it's hard to say no. Decades ago, many were saying no. Accutane is the drug isotrentinoin. It causes serious birth defects. One dose at the wrong time can damage an unborn baby's head, face and central nervous system. Physicians must follow Health Canada rules before writing a prescription. The patient must sign written consent, have two negative pregnancy tests and use two reliable forms of birth control. Experts say still a significant number of women are becoming pregnant on the drug, roughly 100 a year. Researchers say when the drug came to market over 30 years ago, the rules were faithfully followed. We're really scared of the drug. I think familiarity has led to being used in a somewhat more casual way. Dermatologists say they now treat moderate or even mild persistent acne with isotrentinoin. Doctors admit after 30 years, the dire warnings may be getting lost. When industry is trying to promote medications, they will um, support training of physicians. But because isotretinoin Accutane has now become generic, there's much less emphasis on education for physicians. In the U.S., a registry was set up for isotretinoin users. Experts say they're not sure how well it works. The drug is cheap and now it's sold online. If doctors aren't following the rules, experts say they can only imagine the risks young women are taking buying it themselves. Christine Birak, CBC News, Toronto.